Hello guys, um, it's me, it's been a um, long time since I've made a YouTube video, well I made a gameplay, a Tekken gameplay the other day ago, well like a week or two ago, but it's been a while since I've like shown my face, um, and uh, last two weeks I've been gone, I've been uh, China, I was in a total of, I think it was four or five cities, I was in Beijing, Hangzhou, Shanghai, and Xi'an, um, from what I remember. Um, I went to all the um, the main the main tourist attractions such as the Great Wall, Tiananmen Square, um, Forbidden City. It was a lot of places. The Chinese acrobatic show, a lot of cool stuff. And while I was gone, throughout the two weeks, I picked up a lot of great. Um, a lot of great souvenirs, like a lot of them, but the only ones I'm going to focus on today is the anime ones. Um, it's not like a lot, like a dozen, because my luggage couldn't take all of that. Um, so yeah, I'm going to show off. Well, you can see already in the back that I have a few new posters. That's not all of them, but I'm going to show you. I got them from this anime shop in China called Toy Monkey or something like that. Um, it's like this amazing place with like anime all over the place, and they also have really great Peking duck pretzel pies. Um, so yeah, let me um let me show you some of the posters. Okay, um, well that's a scroll. I already had that scroll, and then this poster right there. It's a really awesome poster of like a. Gohan collage. Um, move over here. It's a poster of Goku, Vegeta, Frieza, Chi Chi, Bulma. They're pretty much a collage. Mo majority of these posters were collages. Um, that's what I liked about them, and they had really high um, quality art. And if you look up there, um, It's like Goku, Trunks, Gohan, Piccolo. Um, more collages, but they look really awesome. Um, some of them focus on certain sagas. Um, and up here, we have Goku and Frieza, Ultimate Gohan, Vegeta, Piccolo. Um, over here, some GT, some Goku, some Trunks, some Goten and Trunks, um, Super Saiyan 2 Goku, along with Pan and Shinra in the back. Um, I try to show these as fast as possible so I can get to the other stuff. Um, as you can see, these are the Saiyan Saga, Frieza Saga um, art posters. They're really high quality. Um, here, the last one. Oh yeah, that was already shown. Raditz as the main villain. So yeah, that was the first part of what I got. I got a few other things over here. First thing I want to show you before I got to that um, was one of the um, some of the time that I was alone to walk around. In Shanghai and Hangzhou, um, I went uh, to a lot of McDonald's because I was saving up so I could buy actual souvenirs. So when I was eating at McDonald's, usually at American McDonald's had the Happy Toy meals. The toys usually are from movies, but out in China, One Piece, you know, the pirate anime that everybody knows and loves. Um, I could try to zoom in. It's kind of torn up because, you know, it's just, it's not high quality paper. But I thought this was really cool. That was really cool, so I saved it. Because I'm weird like that. But of course, I don't really care. Um, second thing. Um, this is, well, usually majority of the toys at this shop that I went to, you can just buy one. But this case, I bought one for a 96 won. Um, you divide that by six and you get the conversion factor in the U.S. 
Um, that's somewhere around ten to fifteen dollars, I think. Not too good with my math right now, considering what time it is. Um, and this is Oolong from the original Dragon Ball, and his head is fully 360 turn around. Um, very good, and it's right. It's made out of this like this really good material, and it feels soft and it's hard. Um, I don't know. It's a really cool figure. I had to get it. It looks so great. It looks exactly like the show. Um, next thing, one of the best things I got um, was this extremely detailed Naruto um, Shonen Jump special. It's called Master Star Piece Figures. Um, basically, more or less, I, I haven't measured it yet because I was doing this quite last minute. But this is like a giant, well, sort of giant um, Naruto figure. Um, he doesn't move at all. He, um, but you could tear off his parts, um, his limbs, his legs, his head, his headband, his hair. This is an extremely detailed figure. I'll try to. I had to take him off of his placement so I could be able to show you how he looks. Um, his hair is extremely spiky. This is like a perfect figure. A really amazing figure. Um, there's like no flaws to it. It's one of those masterpiece ones. Um, another thing I got, I got this by the Great Wall, um, in a few shops over there, from some street vendors. Um, this is kind of like fan made, I guess, because it's unofficial. It's Dragon Ball Z like playing cards, like Ace and Jack, not like trading cards. Um, it's like it's really cool. I got it really cheap. It was for 25 won. Of course, again, you divide that by six with the U.S. conversion. Um, they're like each one, each of them has like different characters. It's really cool. Some of them you could tell it's just fan made because some of it has Super Saiyan Five Broly. A lot of these are like portraits from the Budokai Tenkaichi series. Some are just random. I thought this was really cool, and I ad actually ended up using this. Um, what my friends at the conference I was at for two weeks out there in China. Um, yeah, it was really cool, so I had to get it because I am a big Dragon Ball fan. Um, another thing that I got at the street from some street vendors for a really cheap price. Got this for about 21 Of course, you divide it by six again, like I keep saying. This is a Naruto um, fan magazine in China. And this is extremely detailed. It has information about Storm 4, Naruto Online, um, Storm 3 Full Burst. Here, I'll try to flip some pages over for you. Um, it has like so much stuff. Naruto SD manga, the Rock Lee, the, um, Rock Lee manga special on here. Some of the gameplay from Storm 3 Full Burst. Character stuff, cosplay, um, manga of course. Um, a lot of just really cool stuff, and even though I don't read Chinese, if you do the conversion for this, it was around three and a half dollars, and it came with a DVD and a keychain, watch which I will show you. And this is the other side of it, pretty cool. Um, came with this uh, Naruto fan um, fan magazine DVD. Um, it, it basically just has like the opening, the trailer for Storm 3 Full Burst, and um, DLC, and some other stuff like that. Um, it came with this really cool Sasuke keychain. He's got he's got his Sharingan going, and he's casting a Jutsu. Um, really cool. Um, but yeah, that's about it from, from my anime my anime stuff that I got from China. There was like a lot of other things that I got, but you know, of course, China's not about anime. It's not, because that's Japan. So I got like a bunch of historical stuff, like pictures and terracotta soldiers and all that, like a lot of stuff. Great Wall of China stuff. Um, and this, mmm, this is like a sauna in the mouth. This is so delicious. You have to try it. It's, it's amazing. Peking duck dinner, pretzel sticks. I'm pretty sure you've all heard of Pocky. You should definitely try this because it tastes like meat-flavored Pocky, and it's it's beautiful. Um, 
So yeah, that's that's it for me in this video. I hope you guys enjoyed the things I shared, even though I was a little um, a little fast with it. But rate, comment, subscribe. Later.